Today I'm going to show you how to create three different looks using the Blank Canvas Cosmetics Master Series Palette. I've split this palette into three mini ones. So we have the first four in a little palette, the middle four in a little palette, and the last four in a little mini palette. For the first look, we're going to use the first four shades. I've labeled them one, two, three, and four. We're going to start off with a blending brush. We're going to take shade number one. This is going to be applied all over the lid as a base, working up to the brows and also onto the lid. Then we're going to take shade number three on that same blending brush and apply this back and forth in the crease of the eye. Now only apply a very small amount of this. A little goes a long way. And you want to sweep this over and back into the crease and slightly onto the lid as well. Then taking shade number four, we're going to apply this on the outer edge of the eye. So this is our contour shade. So keep this to the outer edge and deep into the crease. Once again, using that same blending brush. Now taking a clean blending brush, we're just gonna soften any harsh lines that might have been created by using those different shades. Particularly because we've been using the same brush to apply everything and we're not cleaning in between. By using a clean blending brush, we're gonna stop that muddy effect. Now I'm gonna cut the crease using a little bit of concealer on an angled brush. Try not to overthink it. Really, you just wanna clean up the inner part of the lid. So just apply a little bit of concealer just on that inner lid part, bringing it right up towards the crease. Then taking a flat brush, we're gonna take shade number one again. And we're gonna tap this over the concealer. This is just to set it in place. It's gonna keep it on there. And then over the top of that, we're gonna take shade number two, which is the only shimmering shade in this palette. And I'm going to use my fingertips just to tap this over the base that we've already cut. Then all you have to do is add some liner and lashes, and there you go. Soft glam look. The next look is one of my favorites, is using palette number two. So the middle four shades, one, two, three, four. We're going to start off using a small brush and shade number one. We're gonna apply this all over the lid. For smoky eye, I like to have like a powdery base just to make sure everything's nice and soft and blended, but I also don't want it to be too light because then it contrasts a little bit too much with the smokiness. This is the perfect shade for this. Taking our blending brush now, we're gonna take shade number three and apply this in the crease of the eye. So work this over and back in the crease of the eye. It's gonna be our highest eyeshadow. So make sure it's nice and soft and blended right up to the brows. Then taking shade number two, we're gonna apply this all over the lid, sticking with that same blending brush. Sweep this all over the lid area. Bring it upwards towards the mid-tone, but don't surpass it. And then take shade number four and apply this with a smaller brush all over the top of shade number two. You wanna slowly build this up, make sure there's lots of depth at the root of the lashes and blending upwards towards the crease. Then simply finish off with liner and lashes. I also applied a little bit underneath my eye as well as a warm liner on the waterline. Look number three is using the last four shades in the palette for this beautiful smoky glam look. So we have one, two, three, and four. We're gonna start off with our blending brush and we're gonna take shade number one and apply this all over the lid. Concentrate this really on the lid area and softly sweeping it upwards into the crease. Sticking with that same blending brush, we're gonna take shade number two. We're gonna focus this on the outer edge of the eye. 
really saturate the outer edge and then you can very softly bring it up into the crease, but keep it nice and low. Taking shade number three now, we're gonna soften out any harsh lines that might have been created with shade number two. Just sweep this over the top of shade number two and then into the crease. And then finally, taking shade number four, we're gonna apply this like a liner on the outer edge of the eye. Now, some of my footage got damaged, so I don't have a lot of this footage, but basically you're just gonna apply it on the outer edge. Then take a clean blending brush and soften out that liner, blending it into the crease slightly to create that soft blended look. Finish off with a little bit of liquid liner and lashes, smudge some of that dark shade underneath, and you're good to go. Hope you guys enjoyed this look. If there's any other palettes that you'd like me to try, definitely let me know, and I'll see you in the next one.